All right, you're watching TVC Breakfast. Let's go into the paper review this morning. I have all of them uh, on my table right now. And uh, to make sense out of all of the headlines this morning, I have with me Olade Indiari, one of our regulars here, to uh, social commentators to make us understand how the headlines are and what they mean. Good morning. Nice to see you. Morning, my brother. How Great. are you today? Well, very fine. Very fine. The way you're sitting is like, ah, Nigerian issues again. Yeah, because I just <laughs> read the story of a professor <laughs> that was kidnapped. Yeah. And they killed his son it's, and it's they terrible. shot his nephew. It's, it's, the it's question really... is, what did he do wrong? Mm. Well, that, that's the, those are the challenges of, secu of insecurity. It could generally. have been anybody. Yeah, actually, it could have been anybody. All right. And it's really sad, I'm telling you. All right. Let's begin with the Daily Times. Daily Times newspaper says, governors set for urgent COVID steps. Governors set for urgent COVID tests. That's the Daily Times this morning. And from there, let's go to the leadership newspaper. Anxiety over rapid spread of COVID-19 as schools resume. Leadership newspaper. Leadership newspaper. The leadership newspaper says, anxiety over rapid spread of COVID-19 as schools resume. All right. Parents reluctant to send wards back to school and partial compliance with protocols across states and tests not requirement for reopening. The federal government is saying this releases 10 billion naira for local vaccines and Nigeria to receive 10 million doses in March. OK, we'll be talking about school resumption shortly. From there, let's go to the Blueprint newspaper. Blueprint. Blueprint says, Amotekun uh, boss Togun. Now, Okada riders from neighboring countries spying for bandits. Okada riders from neighboring countries spying for bandits. As commercial motorcyclists accuses traditional rulers of greed and connivance. Now, Keridulu orders herders out of Undo forests and troops kill 65 in Zamfara. Lose one. Yeah, right? It's still in the area of security there. All right. That's a blueprint newspaper. National Economy is next. National Economy says Nigerian exporters adjust to stringent requirements for exports under the AFC, AFCFTA. That's the Africa Continental Free Trade Agreement. Nigerian exporters adjust to stringent requirements for exports under the Africa, Free, Africa Continental Free Trade Agreement. That's the National Economy. From there, let's go to Business Day. Business Day says, Business Day says, five reasons Nigerians or Nigeria's energy sector not better five years after. Five reasons Nigeria's energy sector not better five years after. Okay, that's uh, the Business Day this morning. From there, let's go to Daily Trust. Daily Trust says, uproar as Akirudulu asks headmen, headsmen to leave Ondo says bad elements masquerading as herders. And that's not what we discussed with governor, as the Mieti Allah is uh, saying this. His directives of, as affront on Nigerian constitution. Alafi assures Fulani of safety tackles Amotekun. Okay, that's the Daily Trust newspaper. From there, let's go to Vanguard. Vanguard says, why I asked herdsmen to quit Ondo forests. Akira Dolu is uh, trying to explain here. Mietiala pleads to meet on next step. And Akira Dolu acted responsibly. Afeni Ferry is saying this. And most Okada riders spy, spy for bandits, uh, foreign kidnappers. Oyo Amotekun is saying, uh, uh, the Amotekun commander in Oyo State is saying this. And the gunmen abduct travelers in Oshun. Okay. That's uh, Vanka newspaper. Now, the Guardian, the Guardian newspaper now is saying Nigeria's real costs exceed AU's estimates by over 100%. Nigeria's real costs exceed AU's estimates by over 100%. Non competitive bidding responsible, says experts and contracts awarded before preliminary designs. The NRC is in better position to speak. On subject, insists Transport Minister, we're not part of contract signing, the NRC says, and Kanu Maradi project signed <laughs> despite AFDB funding advisory. Okay, 
Uh, there's uh, contradictions here and there <laughs> on that <laughs> on that project. So, so how do we uh, know right. the truth? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe a panel of inquiry will be set as usual to look into who is saying <laughs> the fact that, you. you know. <laughs> All right, let's go to the Punch newspaper now. And he's focusing on school resumption. NUT meets Thursday over COVID-19 rules. Partial compliance recorded. Pupils without face masks sent home in Abuja, Enugu, Plateau, and uh, Ondo Ogun states, or sorry, Ondo Ogun schools ignore protocols. Reps panels disagree on resumption. An additional 10 million vaccine doses likely in March, says the federal government. Okay. These are some of the things we'll still be talking about as we open discussion shortly. And from there, let's go to News Direct. COVID-19, another lockdown looms. Okay, governors to meet January 20. Emo government raises alarm over rising cases. And as federal government releases 10 billion for domestic vaccines production. That's the News Direct. The Nation newspaper says 20% uh, of COVID-19 tests returns positive, says the PTF. And SGF said Nigerians must respect protocols to avoid second lockdown. Okay, that's a nation. Now, the last one we're looking at now is that the Sun, Daily Sun, federal government allays fears on COVID-19 vaccines. It doesn't contain microchip, alter DNA. That's a PTF is saying this. <laughs> and warns on second lockdown, releases 10 billion era for domestic vaccines production. Okay, that's... Uh, what we have on the front page of the Daily Sun. All right, uh, we have Funke Treasure joining us right now on set. Funke, good morning. Good morning. Nice to see you. I guess Thank the traffic you. was uh, no, the, something the traffic else. was really good. But you okay. see, when you have to deal with maintenance of cars, okay, and you know, cars can just just yeah, they have do their sometimes thing. they have a brain of their own. <laughs> <laughs> they just do their thing at their own time. Uh, to disagree with you. Uh, no, of course they they, they have the <laughs> that time they they tell you they have a right. You know. <laughs> Thank you for coming. Uh, well, it's good to see. You. Thank you. All right. Schools resumed yesterday, mm -hmm. and in the build up to yesterday, we, 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 we saw different perspectives and different Honestly. opinions as to should schools mm -hmm. resume, should schools not resume, resume, why should schools resume now, and uh, the issues of COVID 19. If we're telling uh, civil servants from grade level 1 to 14, 14 to stay at home, mm -hmm. then when you say their children should go to school, what's the difference? Who should be home? Who should be out you know, there? You know, all of this debate is there. But uh, Alade, what, what do you make it, of, of it's, this really? Uh, it's confusing on one side, mm. frustrating on the other side, okay. and um, frightening. Why? Where is the wisdom in asking adults to stay, to stay away from office mm. while you're asking children who naturally mm have no barriers when it comes to mingling they, and interaction. Also exactly. <laughs> and they've not seen themselves since last year, early last year. And they are meeting for Late the first last time. last year, rather. No, early last year. Mm. Some schools closed very early last year. Mm. January? Yeah. Some well, closed but, but, in but December. But many, many schools yeah. resumed in, yeah. in November, December, uh -huh. period, right. and then they closed so, again. Mm. So for me, it was in Ado. Number two, if those who are going for camping NYC campaign has to come with certificate of testing that they are negative before they will be admitted to the camp. So, I mean, on what premise now are we standing to ask children to return to school untested? Hmm. And you just had PTF saying now that 20 percent of tests Tested cases come out negative. positive. Yeah. I don't know. I'm confused. You see, when you merge all of this together and you want to do a bracket open and close with the NIMC, NIAN crisis, you begin to wonder whether you are in Nigeria, whether you are sane or not. Mm. If I have my way, children will not resume yesterday that they were asked to go back But how long, how long For would you keep them I would at home? Rather, see, I would rather... Mm. I failed my first attempt at school sites. Mm. So what happened? I had to wait for one year. I said something. Mm -mm. No, you're still here. I you're still here. I think it's I mean, so, 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 a rather a child loses the one year than lose his or her life. But no one knows how long. Okay, by but the but way, no yeah. one knows how long this is going to be on. 
Yeah. If we yeah. say students should stay home and remain at home because uh, of, of the rising cases, uh, would that not be counterproductive at the end mm. of the day? Um, there are different schools of thought. Mm. Uh, for me, I think it's a policy somersault uh, for you to say this one uh, um, um, is for this group of people and then this group of people can go and die, mm. can resume and then get infected and die. But I think, um, again, it tells a lot about the body language of, of our leaders. Uh, one minute you're saying this is deadly, stay at home. One minute you're saying you people, you can go, go out and die. Thirdly, I think this is where, again, I come back to the National Orientation Agency. I'll tell you why. <laughs> my, I spoke with my mother, and she said, I said, I hope you're using your masks, because she's, she's, she's successful, she's at that age mm. uh, gap. Um, and she said, ah, we use it, but you know, they laugh at us when we go to the markets in Ibado. People laugh at you when you wear your masks. <laughs> because you're the, you're the black sheep out. You're, yeah. the, you're the odd one. And tell you what, at the late night market I went to yesterday, there I was, you know, trying to buy something. The woman said, the thing where you put for mouth, not let me hear it till they talk. Oh, this, uh, this is when they talk. So, no, 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 you. Hmm. And I was looking at this woman in shock. There she was, oh, late night market, selling all of them no masks. And there she was telling me hmm. that. Is a lie. All those things that they tell me now. <laughs> so then you tell that such a person to take her child to school. Of course, she'll send her child to school mm. without um, um, a mask. But this is where responsibility, leadership responsibility comes in. You as a school owner, what are you putting, putting in place? Yeah. The teachers can pass these things amongst themselves and to the children. That's on one hand. So what have you put in place? Are you going to have a nurse in there? Do you have masks to give the children as a social, a corporate social responsibility? Mm -hmm. Do you have those things for, for the children to use as they come in? Number one. Number two, um, at the end of the day, when people say stay at home for these people, you look at the quality of education in Nigeria as well. And then you look at um, the rate at which we educate people. And then you say, do you want to keep people impoverished and in poverty? And then uh, at the end of the day, we'll have people drop out of school. Would you rather have people drop out of school or you have them killed? If this is not a deliberate um, attempt to reduce the population of this country, then our leaders need to, you know, think right and do the right thing. Mm. We don't want to lose our children. All right. Now, yesterday, our, our correspondent, Sharon e. Jackson, was at, you know, connect, co connected to us live right. from one of the schools. And right behind her, from what we were seeing live on TV, I saw, I saw the report. were children, students dragging each other, well, you know, hugging. Some hugging each other. Yes. You know, See, at that all of age, that. even and this that is morning, the same thing mm. this morning. That is the normal thing you expect them to do. If they would do otherwise, then they won't be children. Mm. Understand that. Now, for those of us who have children in school, we have had to buy face masks in packets. Mm. Uh, we bought large jar of uh, sanitizer and then smaller sizes, mm. mobile ones that they can go they can around have in with. their bags. Yeah, some children have the consciousness to maintain all of these protocols, okay. while a whole lot more do not have it. So how do we go? Now, not all uh, students are in the boarding house. Mm. If you say those that came to the boarding house, they were tested before being admitted. What happened to these students? Exactly. What happened Coming to from teachers? Home. Mm. Precisely. Because... See, we've had so many parties around the country that you wonder, oh, is it possible? People are still going to parties. Somebody sent me, I should be yesterday, <laughs> despite the fact that I have stopped going to parties. Mm. If I stop going out, I have stopped going out. From here, I'm going back to my house. Mm. You know, just that's, that's the only better. place you will see yesterday. me. That's better. The only I place see. you will see me tomorrow yeah. is a radio station and on Saturday. Mm. Outside of that, enlightening, you can't see me enlightening on people so on, if, on if these I issues. I can take myself yeah. away from harm's way. Why then are we pushing our children to what I would call the dangerous route? Okay, I don't see adult. All right, Let, may forget, parties, forget this. May parties not be the death of us in this country? Oh. Mm. Why do we like parties so much <laughs> at the risk of no, dying? That, that's 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 our life generally. <laughs> so I, I tell you, and jollof, no, the, party the, 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 the point, the faji, the point there is Nigerians will like it. And then like out shackle each uh, other. No, of course, that's, that's, that's that was a wedding in December. 
And I was also about, I didn't attend the wedding. Mm. The groom's mother died oh, no. after the wedding from COVID complications. You mm. know, we've read enough. We, I, like I told somebody yesterday. What else? I this is know, not about the government yeah, now. Exactly. December and today, I know Stop more than 20 to people who have died for COVID-19. Yeah. Now, with all of that consciousness, and you think I will not put my life on the line because mm. of your father's rights or I'm on our wall. Please, yeah. party your love. Pa party I mean, your love, see, exactly. an unusual situation. <laughs> and small choice. An unusual situation demands unusual solution. Yeah, if phone. children are to stay at home, so be it. Unfortunately, we have not made use of technology to develop online teaching. Mm. Yes, a lot of schools did that. Last year, it's expensive. I would have expected it it's is expensive. Expensive. Uh, at least we saw, at least we saw, we saw some Hello. viral videos from China or, on how when students Man. come in, the, the protocols of a student entering the school premises <laughs> and then from the school gate to the school classroom and all of that, and the sitting down and so on. Mike, but but here we are in Nigeria. Life, if yes. you are saying that is expensive. You speak for yourself. Uh, you no, can no, afford it. It's not it. about me. No, yeah. You can no, afford no, it, but a lot of people we, we, need, we need to face the realities of who we are and what we are and how we are. See, like, when, we say, when, we, when we try to classify it mm. and say, I can afford it, the average Nigerian out there has a device. Maybe I'm using iPhone, I'm using Chinese phone. We all buy credit. We all know. We all shout. We all talk. Yeah, but I read, no, what you say, I, I, all of us. I, I, I understand. I have five I, children I, I, in the school. You want me to buy mobile phones for the five and no, give them data plus my own? Uh, uh, and I sell vegetable. Okay. I sell vegetable uh, uh, by the roadside. You that doesn't want to buy data for five people who willingly send me um, money if I told you I'm broke. It's no. a matter of prioritizing. I know. The, the, it's a matter no, of the, the, the point having is, the purchasing the, power the, the, the to point do such is, a thing. A, lo a lot of Nigerians... We're talking about the mass, a, the masses. A, a, a lot of Nigerians are going through a lot. I'm not I'm and that, immune and, to it, and, and that is even why... Even business no, of course, owners. But, but, there are, but there are categories. Must I tell you, I tell from home to this person. If I hear, if I hear, like he used to say. If I hear, like he used to say. I am looking like this. Now, let's take it to the schools now. Right. Now, the, the schools have resumed. Whether we are still debating, parents are still... The schools have resumed. They have. There are students in schools already. Now, the authorities within the school, their capacity and ability, or maybe the knowledge to maintain those protocols, I, I wonder how much of that you see in, in, um, within the school authorities to say, we don't want so, so, many, so many persons clustered in here. Now, for instance, Lagos State has said some of the schools should stagger you know, uh, you know, resumption into some being in the morning and then others coming They're in the afternoon assembly. and all of that. But what do you make of that? I think that will, that, that's a measure. Okay. I mean, you can criticize government, but when they, all, when they do well, mm. um, they, they deserve to be appreciated. Yeah. I think that's a, that's a very sane, sensible thing yeah. uh, proposed by the... I remember I went to afternoon school by sometime the legal in Paris. Yeah. Yeah. You know, yeah. it's just that some of these things have been a long time they were done in Nigeria, so it looked like we never did them yeah. before. Yeah. But if you did that, that would be, that would be a way to um, control... Um, social distancing, mm. crowding, and, and all of that. And convergence of people. However, again, you can only control as many people, give a directive, and, and do a policy, uh, create a policy. What about compliance? What about enforcement? Will Lagos State send forth their, or send out their mm. education officers mm. to ensure compliance? The Commissioner of Education went round yesterday. He said all the directors in the in the ministry were all going out to different schools. They have teams. To how many schools? Do what what schools will directors and the Commissioner of Education <laughs> do? How there. many places can... Ajiromi oh. fellow do a local government alone. They can't do it in one day. <laughs> so let's not easy. let's not uh, uh, make others look like fools. In, in a bony you state, you will have education officers who you would assign <laughs> yeah. to go to those in, in places. In a bony state, for instance, we got the report that uh, the government decided to send nurses into schools. Fools. So they are there permanently a, to, to ensure good the, the health. Which is help. another measure. I heard no. you no. guys discuss mm. that yesterday. Yeah, exactly. no. I thought that was a good one. No. There was a conspiracy theory, which I found very hard to entertain. Okay. Some people said private school owners were behind this resumption. Why? Because they want to collect school fees. Last year was terrible for all of them. And I said, 
That's a very narrow way of thinking. Of looking it's at a it. selfish the way of thinking. The same person still told me that uh, NYC contractors are behind the by fire by force NYC campaign exercise going on. You know, this is where, like you mentioned earlier, I see fault NOA. And I'm sure my friend at is listening. At the end of the day, is My friend no is way. listening. Because there's still, there's still a vacuum that they need to occupy. That's the vacuum of public enlightenment exactly. and mass education. Well, remember the days of Mamsa? Yeah. You where have the, the, to they reach were the people I at the grassroots. I said it the other day that by now we should have jingles mm. that people will be reciting easily if you are a director, direct well, mm. if you are a teacher, teach well, <laughs> if I govern, kinds govern of things well. we can't forget. Yeah. There is nothing to so remind all, all us that, things, you know. I, I think we, really, we still need to look in that direction. Mm. We still need, and I want to thank the private media and for, for, for taking the gauntlet, you know, yeah. for stepping in because the vacuum is just there and nature avoids vacuums. Yeah. Especially now that children are in school, we can't afford to keep quiet. You we see, must continue to ring the bell. Okay. Let them know Let that they quickly, must respect the protocol. Let All me right. quickly drop, as I said the other day. I mean, I, I saw the links your friend sent to me as well. Fantastic. I haven't even clicked He's on our them. Friend. Uh, our <laughs> friend. Our friend. You see, you can do all of that work you are targeting people can a, a certain class of people. Mm. What about the majority? The majority yeah. the lower like the, the, ladder. the woman I bought stuff from at the mm -hmm. market yesterday, mm -hmm. telling me mm. that and there is no this, such this thing. You're wearing, this thing yeah, and I just wasting our time. Mm. So where is the pigeon jingle mm. or the, and the language, ones in different language languages. jingle mm. that you have created and you're giving heavy rotation mm. on radio and TV to educate these people, to tell them that this is not a disease for the rich and wealthy. Mm -hmm. Because they believe it's for the rich and exactly. wealthy. Exactly. So yeah. there's a lot of work to be done. National Orientation Agency. Our children need, well, they listen to radio with their parents. Mm. They need to sing, as they sing along, it registers inside them that I am not supposed to do this. As they're resuming, there should be jingles already mm. made for the resumption. Yeah. Mm. And in fact, the good thing with social media is you, you make these short jingles they go viral. And they go viral. Exactly. They keep Freely. sharing it. They keep sharing it from the phone on people, social WhatsApp media. And all National Orientation Agency has no such jingle <laughs> that has gone viral. I'm not or that maybe there are. Maybe we are. We that are has gone viral. Uh, and I should see uh, it. Maybe it has not no gone viral worry, to this, our area after yet. After this, yeah. I will call my friend in Abuja <laughs> and ask him to update me mm. next Tuesday. I promise you. Mm. I'll have to update So now you're the spokesperson <laughs> for anyone. <anyway. laughs> no, no, because... Me, me, well me. done. Good uh, job. They call them, the day we called NOA out, mm. the gentleman took the pains to look for me on Facebook. Mm. I commend him. He did got in touch with me. And things to you. He did. Before I left, my inbox was already loaded okay. with yes, information. Indeed. With, with what I they are trying to do. And I read that, and then we started chatting. I, I, I told him that, look, you guys can't say you are online. How many of Niger how many Nigerians are online? Mm. All the time, like I mean. So, and he tried to explain a lot of this. Then we moved to WhatsApp. He sent me more pictures, and I, I assure you, he's watching. That's why I'm saying this. So okay, watch and I do will the jingles. Engage with him again. The, watch the and point do the is, jingles. Right. Effort, it is one thing to put effort into all of those. No, no, the, for, so far, it's another thing it, for Nigerians it, to feel the impact. To re, to you know, you remember the, efforts, the days of Mamsa? To receive the efforts. Yes. The, the, you remember it's the days of Mamsa? Repetition. Oh, be, Mamsa did now. not have to tell Nigerians we are working. Mm -mm. Everybody mm -mm. felt it, the impact. They threw it in our faces. The, down down in our villages, mm -hmm. we could hear Mamsa, we could hear all of those okay, messages. You are they in the village. I was in the city. <laughs> <laughs> I remember we are the ones to make Nigeria a better. Exactly, uh, exactly. We all have to do it. Of is course. Like, remember the Andrew, the Andrew, the Andrew, checking out there. Exactly. Yeah, you know, I'm checking out. And there. then even the one you said, uh, if you are a senator, say it well so and all of that. If I governor, government well, we if I can't can't Professor uh, Jerry Gana, we can't forget, forget all those okay. things. I'm going to Abuja tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> Go work with NOA. Go and talk stay with your home. friends. Stay home. 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 Stay for the, for the township or for the cities or the met metropolis, a lot of people say the information is out there. It's, there seems to be information fatigue where people hear these things so often that it is no longer of any effect. It's because, again, there's, yeah, but then again, the body language of the government, okay. I will bring it back to the government. And it's not that I don't like this particular government, it's just that... Uh, Sorry, are the state, federal or local government? All of them. 
together. <laughs> I remember yesterday there was a, at the onset of COVID nineteen. I remember Lagos fumigating places. Mm -hmm. Have you seen any kind of fumigation since mm. April? So I come back to the government. No more fumigation. Is it that we're just fine? Mm -hmm. That's number one. Number two, if I want to fumigate, what, what are, you're not putting that outside. If I want to do that for my uh, um, premises or for my personal building, who do I go to, where do I? You see, when you continue to put that in, out there to the public, people still have that consciousness. There won't be fatigue. You have to be creative about mm. the way you do these mm. things. And it's not rocket science where all, both of us are in the media, yeah. right? We know how to do these things and do them well. Yeah. That's number one. Number two, you can't say stay at home and tell me to go and register for NIN as well. Mm -hmm. You can't say stay at home, but people are coming in from all kinds of places mm. for, from the earth. And they're coming with all kinds of variants. Now we have the variant that just strikes and people are dead yeah. immediately, almost immediately. Yeah, so so, yeah, so I mean, you've opened the borders. And I know that people have to eat. People in the aviation industry have to eat. But at the same time, um, people eat and then a lot of people die. Yeah, yeah, at the yeah. end of the day, what have you achieved? Exactly. The borders mm. are still open. We don't the want that, a lockdown. All right. The one that concerns me now, mm. it's about uh, the well-to-do who keep organizing high-octane parties. Oh. And that sends very wrong signals wrong signal. to the masses. We, we recall that uh, the NCDC you DG know, was it, saying it says, that there will be consequences for what happened through the December period, you know, the you know, so, tide. Not only, not only mm. that, we've had parties this year mm. where uh, the, the big and the high and the mighty assembled. Now, when we hear those in government telling us don't uh, go to where there is a crowd, mm. face mask, sanitizer. And then you and see the same viral faces. videos. You see them <laughs> at parties, dancing to music or eating or doing whatever. How do you reconcile the mm. two? What they're doing, confusing. they're confusing. extending and expanding yeah. the divide between the government and the government. Yes. They All right, we, we, have, we, have, we have to leave you here now. I, I guess everyone who this message is directed at, which, which is all of us, we're, we're, we're listening, and uh, we have to do the need for. Thank you very much, Aladdin in the area, for coming. My on the pleasure. Program. Okay, thank you so thank much. You. Thank, thank you. Thank you for so coming. Thank well you. done. Okay.